everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be my first update in the Finish 4x4 challenge. And if you're not familiar with this challenge, it was started by Amber F in the beginning of May and it consists of finishing four makeup beauty or skincare related items by the 4th of July. So I kind of jumped on the bandwagon a little bit late. I filmed my intro video at the end of May, but that's okay. I'm still participating in the challenge. And today I am going to be showing you the progress that I've made in the last two weeks since my first intro video. So the first item that I'm going to be updating you on is from Clinique and it is the Rinse Off Eye Makeup Solvent. This product I had kind of sitting in my bathroom cupboard. It's not that I don't like it. I like it, but I was using the Bioderma eye makeup remover. So this one was kind of getting neglected and just sitting there doing nothing. So I decided to pull it out and put it in this challenge so that I could use it up and get it out of the bathroom cupboard. <laughs> So the first time that I used this product, I kind of want to make it a secret, but I was here. And for this update, I am totally finished. So that's really awesome. I'm super excited about that. Um, I'm not really surprised that I finished this product because I do use um, makeup remover every day basically except for maybe some days on the weekend. Um, so yeah, this is totally gone. So that's one down and three to go. The next item I'm going to be updating you on is from Maybelline New York and it is one of the Baby Lips Lip Balms. The one that I have is number 80 and it's in the color Berry Balm. I have it on my lips today. So um, the first time that I showed you this in my intro video, I held it up against the cap and then you can see you could see that I was at the top of this B and at the bottom of this B. I was in the middle of B's. So now I will show you my progress. And I am in about the middle of the B there. So I've made quite a bit of progress, about half a B's worth of progress. And I'm really happy with the progress that I've made. I don't find these uh, lip balms very hydrating, so I am using a lot of other products right now. Um, but um, I definitely think I could finish this by the 4th of July. If I concentrated on it, I wouldn't have any problem finishing that, so I'm not too worried about this product. The next item I'm going to update you on is from DKNY, and it is one of their perfumes called Be Delicious. And... I just have a small bottle, it's 15 milliliters, so not that much. Um, and the first, what I've done to show you my progress is I've turned the product upside down and drawn a circle where I was the, the first time in my intro video. And then now you'll be able to see from that line to where I am now, the progress that I've made. So this is, can you see this line right here? Like now I'm tilting it so it doesn't look like I made that much pro progress. But if I hold it like this, just straight up and down, you can see the line is right up here. And then I have made like that, that much progress between the line and then where it is now. And then that is what it looks like right side up. So we'll see, maybe I'll draw a line here as well this time and then I'll be able to show them both ways next time. I think that's a good idea. The last item I'm going to be updating you on is from Sephora. It is one of their nail polishes. It's a glittery gold nail polish. For some reason I peeled off the sticker so I don't have the name anymore. But last time that I filmed I was right there. I drew a line there and then this time I am down here. So that is one manicure and one pedicure that I got out of that. It's getting quite gloopy right now so it's hard for me to use but I've been using a toothpick to get it out of there so that's helped a bit. And I want to keep going and trying to see like how far I can get get down before it becomes absolutely unusable. So that is it for my first update to the Finish 4x4 challenge. I hope that you all enjoyed it, that you're having a great week. My next video is most likely going to be the update to the Pan That Palette challenge, so keep your eye out for that. And yeah, I will see you all soon. Take care. Bye.